approximately 30 feet. Uh, additional resources were requested from uh, special operations. They responded, uh, packed some patient along with EMS, and he was removed with a rope system out of the hole, uh, turned over to EMS for transport to the hospital. I'm not sure the destination. And how would you describe the operation? Somewhat complicated? It was a, a complex uh, rescue, but we had multiple units here. They worked in concert, and everything went very smoothly. And and he what, was, what size hole did you have to dig or do a special short? No, it's a short, construction right? site with, uh, with a whole bunch of uh, rebar involved and everything. Uh, there was no major injuries, so he was just packaged as a precaution, and they used the ropes uh, to lift him out of the hole. And he was being treated while he was down there? He was treated as soon as uh, we arrived, but he was stable, and, uh, and, he, and he's still stable in Rapsa Hospital at this point. Was there like shoring up for bracing? Or, no, 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 none of those no. things were necessary, just uh, placed it in, in, a, uh, in a stretcher, and a rope system was set up for the rope. the gentleman come out did he look visibly uh, hurt or was he was he seem okay it's really hard to tell, hard to tell. He's, he, he seemed okay but uh, he, didn't, he didn't move or anything he, didn't, he just was lying there so you don't know and in all the commotion what like what did you feel what, what did it make you feel like well to me it's really really sad first of all well this is my neighborhood and so there's always something happening here you see all this and i pass this site every day it's so sad, there's a man working so hard to support his family. 